children, I'm here to read you a story again. This story is called Scott's Birthday Party. And this story, I'm not sure whether it makes me a bit sad because my friends can't come to a birthday party or whether it makes me happy because I can remember about my friends and about the happy times we've had and the things I've done with my family. Let's have a read of it and find out what Scott did on his birthday. Start at the beginning. It's Scott's birthday. Let's play hide and seek. It's counting. Counting one, two, three. That's all he's counting to, just three. He says, ready or not, here I come. Wonder, whose tail could this be that's hiding under the rug? Whose tail would it be that's green? Shall we see? Let's see if it's black. There, it's Crocodile. And he says, not yet, he wasn't ready. Spot didn't do much counting, did he? Let's see who he's going to find next. Spot has found someone behind the curtain. Can you see his big furry feet? Who is it going to be that's that tall with brown furry feet? Shall we see? <gasps> it's Bear. And Bear says that was quick. <gasps> Can you see what Bear's doing? Bear is eating the jelly. Oh. Pink and green and yellow and pink and red. Yummy coloured jelly. Spot's going to keep on looking. And he thinks somebody's in the cupboard. Can you see their tail just there? Who would fit in the cupboard? I wouldn't fit in a cupboard. You wouldn't fit in a cupboard. Who could it be? Mm. I can hear a Snake was in the cupboard. And the snake said, Oh, hiss. It's going to keep on looking. Come out, Spot. I can see you. Look, can you see the shadow there? There's somebody behind the shower curtain. Who could it be? He likes water. <gasps> it's Hippo. Hippo's getting nice and clean. Isn't this fun, says Hippo. Spot heard somebody giggling. Who could it be? Can you see their feet at the bottom there? Who could be giggling behind the coat? <gasps> it's Penguins. And Penguin said, she tickled me. That's why they were giggling. You can't be noisy when you're hiding, can you? You have to be quiet. Shh. And you have to be really still. No giggling. That's a silly way to hide, says Spot. Is that hiding? No. All this animal is doing is hiding their face. We can see all of their body and their tail. Let's look at that. Lion still trying to cover his face and hide. No, it's not a good thing, place to hide, is it? Spot knows who's behind the door. How does Spot know? Look, can you see the clue? Somebody's left something there. Who'd leave a banana? Who could it be? Spot knows. monkey says, how did you find me? Uh-oh, don't leave your bananas on the floor, monkey. Spot will know. Someone's under the table. Can you see? Can you see that tail? Who would be under the table? saying, don't tell Spot. 
Spot knows, doesn't he? Spot knows he's under the table. Look, Spot's getting all excited. He's looking under the cushion. And who's there? It's his friend Turtle. Turtle says, I'm last. Spot's found everyone, hasn't he? And look, they're saying, calm down, Spot. He's getting excited. It's his birthday. Happy birthday, Spot. Thank you, says Spot. If it's your birthday soon, you could play hide and seek. You could play hide and seek with your family at home. You could play hide and seek with your toys. You could think about who you could play hide and seek with when you come back to preschool. Or when you go to the park. But not yet. We've got to wait till we can see all of our friends, haven't we? We've got to wait and remember all of the good times we've had. And all of the good times we're going to have when we can see our friends and lots of our family again. Happy birthday if it's your birthday soon or today. Have fun everyone.